When I left school, I only had two O-levels. And the fact that my first job was in a lampshade factory, I think they didn't think I would amount to much. And now that I'm a section leader, I think my dad's actually um, proud of me. I'm Debbie Morgan and I'm a biomedical scientist. Basically, I dissect bits of people. We're looking for um, disease, things like inflammation, cancer, infection, that sort of thing. You either start off with little biopsies or like whole organs, so you might get a whole bowel or a whole liver. When you've got like the gross specimens, like the whole organs and things, you just have to shut off to what it is, really. Otherwise, you would just go a bit doolally. But then, then it's all kind of like good because you're helping people. At school, I didn't get on particularly well. I didn't like school. I didn't like doing homework or anything like that. I knew I was practical and I liked making things, but I was just more interested in getting out, getting money in my pocket, getting a motorbike. And I had a few jobs. I worked in a factory. I worked in a wood brokerage firm. Then I went traveling with my sister, went to Australia for a year. And then when I got back, I was unemployed for about six months. And my mum got fed up with me being at home. So she saw an advert in the histology lab and she stuck her foot up my backside and maybe go and apply. When I first started working here, I actually worked in the cytology department doing their prep work. I did have a funny five minutes in the middle of the first week and I got very confused and I remember standing in the middle of the little lab one day, bursting into tears going, I don't understand. <laughs> 18 months later, I was, had it so under control, I was wandering around annoying everybody else because I was like too efficient. I started doing a degree but in histology, I thought, actually, I need to knuckle down and decide what I'm doing here. And I actually discovered that I enjoyed it more. It's much more manual. It's just really practical and it's kind of creative in a strange kind of way. I think I've just been really lucky that I've fallen into this and it just suits me really well. I very much enjoy um, the practical side. I didn't choose to come here, but now I'm here, I really like it.